my name is Hao Fang, and I'm the team leader of our team sounding board. We want to build a board that uh, engages users in an informative and uh, interesting conversation and by actively understanding users in terms of their personality and their sentiment. We have really the first bot that I've interacted with that actually knows how to bring up new content and can kind of try to see which one is sticking. One thing I underestimated is how many people really appreciate having someone to talk to, um, even if it's just a bot, but something to bounce ideas off of, a more interactive way of finding out about news, um, about the world. I think the main thing that we contributed is that we showed we can just take a lot of data and start to look at, in a very personal way, what someone wants to talk about and get a flow going there. Being able to talk like a human is what, I mean, people in the 50s envisioned. I was very impressed by what my team was able to accomplish. They've come a long way. The, the system has changed quite a lot from when we first started. I'm impressed at how user-focused and the attention to detail and thinking about the system. They've all really bought into that idea. Alquist is special because it can talk about broad ranges of topics. Up to now there are just some personal assistants which can answer you some questions. But Alquist can talk almost about anything. Well, the goal of the project was to push conversational AI, natural language processing, understanding and generation. But we actually started to put more and more work into dialogue design and into the things that our bot actually says so that they are interesting and they are engaging for the user. I believe that the greatest thing about Alquist is that it's not only the social bot, but, but it's a framework. It makes us easy to develop a new dialogues uh, about uh, almost anything. I think that the future of conversational AI will look similar to what we are doing now. I worked a long time in speech recognition and uh, it took maybe 30 years before we saw Alexa, which is really making our dreams happen. And now we can say, Alexa, tell me this and that, and it really works. I am the team leader of WhatsApp Bot Team, which developed the Alana system. One of the key features of our system is that it's not restricted by topics. So users interact with Alana through just natural everyday conversation. They don't have to give specific commands, they can just speak normally to the system and they can expect a socially intelligent response. It was a very difficult challenge. Um, imagine you have to talk to a complete stranger for 20 minutes, someone you've never met. Um, that's even difficult for a human to do. Um, so for an AI system, that's even more difficult. And she's very good at taking the initiative when the user is not, but she's also very good at responding to the user uh, when they have a topic that they want to talk about. So basically it doesn't impose any, any boundaries or, or constraints on what the user can, can say. It gives me an understanding of how complex conversational AI actually is. <laughs>